getting ready to take up his turbo timber for the first time water maiden and we'll see how this goes see if he can miss the rocks out there today oh yeah no problem half laps up uh, what a difference of power from that carbon <laughs> oh yeah a big night and day difference yeah all, yeah, all kind of power now oh, yeah yeah we'll just take a couple nice easy laps here and maybe do a couple landings and couple touch and goes yeah absolutely if you do your touch and goes if you go from that side to this side and, and those rocks yeah yeah exactly you know uh, what i normally do is i go right out to that tree line then i start bringing her down you know with my timbers beautiful day brother beautiful day. day beautiful plane look how pretty that plane looks in the air Oh boy, that's landing there. Oh, oh, a couple little bounces, eh? That's okay. You, 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 it takes time to get used to that, you know. It's different than on the land, isn't it? <laughs> it takes a little time to get used to used to getting that perfect touch and go with them. Well, I was gonna just kind of do a landing since I was coming right at us. All right. Well, I usually do it crossways, you know. That way, I just watch the, I watch my floats, you know. Keep my tips up just a little bit, not too much. Yeah, she's pretty in the sky. Very pretty plane in the sky. There you go. Nice. Oh, there you go. Take it right back up. A little splash. That's, well, you know, it's no worries. And then the sun isn't working with us. It's kind of right in their face off to the right. Yeah. Got the lights in the front. That looks cool. Oh, yeah. Look at that with the trees in the background. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, yeah. Okay. You still got your half laps on. Yeah, just doing a really nice slow. Oh, yeah. Well, like I said, you can land any direction here today with no, no wind like this. We've got very little wind. Even up, even the, uh, even in the upper atmosphere, I wasn't getting no wing rock. So, you know, usually you get up 150, 200 feet and you get that little wing, wing rock, let you know there's wind up there, you know? Yeah. And not today. No, it's a beautiful day. Yeah, uh, gorgeous day. Look how pretty that is coming in. Yeah, beautiful, brother. That's a beautiful takeoff there. You see, you see what I mean by not giving it too much when on your takeoff. Yeah, just a nice little manager. Not, yeah, manager, manager speed. If you if you jam that throttle, she'll tip right over on you. She's got that much power. You know what I'm saying? She'll tip it. She'll tip it right over. I'm watching that rock. Yeah, well, I was worried more about that keep it keep it more out out, yeah. out when you do it. That's what I do. I stay away from those damn rocks. Yeah, two rocks. They have to be right here. Well, that's the way it goes. I mean, <laughs> you know, you got to mother nature. Right? Yeah, you, you got to deal with the water level being lower today. You know, it hasn't rained in a few days, so the, and it's going to get even worse. Yeah. yeah, I'm not complaining because we're finally getting some dry weather. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no doubt about it. It's supposed to be dry all next week, too. So that which is a good thing. Now, now you see that little wing slap you got at the end. Yep. Okay, you have to be careful not to slap that wing too hard. It'll crack it. It will crack it on the water. Water's hard. Huh? Water's hard. Yeah. Well, and I cracked my wing on the water. I did. Yeah, on mine. Of course, now I just glued and taped it back together. <laughs> so fine. <you know? laughs> 
That's why I got black tape on my wings, you know. I mean, because I, yeah, I cracked it's, both it's of them. It's yours. It's custom. It's the way you like it. That's the way. Well, works. actually, I'd like to have it where I don't have the cracks in the wings, but I slapped it on the water pretty damn hard, you know. Like I said, once those floats, once those uh, floats get on plane, it doesn't take much pullback, and you're up in the air with that bad boy. And the twin, and the twimbers even more so. But like I said, I gotta, I get different floats for it. It's just, it's just too, too short of a float, you know, too short of a float. It needs to be longer in the front and more curved up, so I'm not getting a bite when I come down. And then again, anytime you got any kind of waves, you always run the risk of getting a float bite, you know. Then she's going over, I'll presume, or at least one side. Well, it don't take much to flip it over. Hence the reason I got the RC boat here. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, we ought to get that out and do a little video of that. Have you ever done that, just a video on the boat? Oh, yeah, I did the last time I was here. I did a rescue mission with it. I flipped my... UMX twin over and had to go get it. But I think right here, this is just beautiful as far as water goes. And oh, yeah. Scenery. It'd be pretty cool to do a couple minutes just with the boat. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, we can run it out there and let you go, let you play with it for a while. <laughs> I, I, I am just really relaxed today. I just like today is my, you know, that. yeah, you know. I just want to keep, keep relaxed and enjoy my soda and enjoy the weather. And yeah. Enjoy the scenery here. This oh, and enjoy your time. Enjoy your time with John B. Always, <laughs> always a good time. Yeah, always have a good time. Mm hmm No matter what, repairing. Well, that's, well, that's what friends are for, right? You know. Yeah. There you go. Nice. Ew. Yeah. I thought you were gonna. Yeah. I was just getting. A nice I, I, I thought you was. I thought you was going to do that little bit of a wing drag on the water there. You know, yeah, you know play, playing around doing the do, doing the water skim with the wing tip. You know, <laughs> we're not there yet. Yeah, you are. Doing, yeah, you are. She'll be cartwheeling over. Uh, 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 okay, let, let, let me put it this way. Yes, you are. You can do it. You just have to take your time and do it. And if you flip it over, I got an RC recovery boat. So. <laughs> yeah. The, the trick is, is you just barely want to touch that wing when you do a skim. Of course, I couldn't have landed much farther away. Well, that's okay. What was wrong with that? That was a nice splash oh, and go. A... You, right. you know, that, that that's the whole trick about learning learn, learn to fly on, on water is there's different stunts you can do on water that you can't do on land. You can't do a skim on land. You know, with the wing, you're going to rough it up. But on water, you can do it all day, you know. I know guys that actually have glued floats to the tips of their wings just to do that. Really? Yep. Yeah. Hey, a piece of foam. And... Yeah, well, that's all I did. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Close. And there she is. And there she is. How much time you got left? I have 29 seconds. I'm I'd go. Check. I'd go up one more time. <laughs> I would go up one more time. I, I got 29 seconds. I'm going to fly that 29 seconds out. <laughs> I have more battery. <laughs> yeah, but you know what look I'm saying. Look at that baby coming in there. Doesn't that look beautiful? It is.